some trailers. Hello, my name is Hannah and welcome to my channel. Say hello to Chair if you want to take a minute to say hello to Chair. If you get it, you get it. If you don't, well, I haven't streamed in a while, so I'm gonna get back to it. Today we're gonna do something a little bit different because I have a few trailers for movies that I actually wanna watch and in the past I have been avoiding doing that on this channel and I've mostly been doing that on my other channel because those videos get demonetized. So if you wanna help me out, please watch another video after this. But today we are gonna be watching the trailers for Fallout and Borderlands, which I am very interested in, very curious about because as you know, if you've watched my channel, I very often say at the end of watching a very cool game trailer, I would love to watch that movie. And now uh, maybe I can. Before we get to that, thank you so much to my channel members. I really appreciate your support, especially with my sporadic posting. Thank you so much for sticking with me. I always try and answer channel member comments. I search for them specifically and try and answer as many comments as I can. Also, if you did not already know, I am a self-published author and these are my books. Magic required and dominion required follow the story of a Celtic demigod trying to seek a redemption he is not sure he deserves. And I actually just, well, not just, maybe by the time this is posted, we'll have had my third Lachlan book sent back to me from my editor. I'm very excited about that, so that's coming soon. Bloodkin and Curses follows a newly turned vampire discovering a world she never knew existed and trying to avoid an ancient curse. They are available as audiobooks, ebooks, and paperbacks. Thank you so much if you have read them. Thank you even more if you have reviewed them. And if you're just here to watch some video game turned movie trailers with me, let's get into it. Maybe I'll talk a bit about this at the end if I remember, but I saw Rosencrantz and Guildenstern are dead this week with Billy Boyd and Dominic Monaghan. So I saw Billy Boyd and Dominic Monaghan with these eyeballs, these very eyeballs saw them. We'll talk about it later or maybe on a stream or maybe another video. Let's watch this Fallout trailer. Hello there. Hi. I'm here to show you a wonderful place. I don't know if I believe you, sir. A veritable Camelot, the nuclear age. Not made by God Almighty, but the working man. Oh, him! That guy! You I know that guy. Purchasing a residence in a vault tech vault today. Because if the worst should happen tomorrow, the world is gonna need you to build a better day after. Oh, right, and it does happen. Right. The mission of the vaults should be important to everyone. The mission of the vaults. Come up to the surface one day and restart civilization. Oh. Tell me what's happened in the last 200 years. 200 years. Holy shit. You're an actual vault dweller. <gasps> I, <am. laughs> I thought all you dipshits were dead. <laughs> I don't accept the word. It isn't like the vault on fire. I just want to start. <gasps> I've had a rough week. Practically every person I've met up here has tried to kill me. I'm simply going to harvest your organs. Huh? Oh! You need to go home. Him! You come from a world of rules, of laws. You should not be alone. Why did you join the Brotherhood? To hurt the people who hurt me? People are going to come after you. Ain't much stage clean up here, Vaulty. Oh! Well, now that is a very small drop in a very, very large bucket of drugs. You look out at this wasteland. It looks like chaos. But there's always somebody behind the wheel. Was Noseless Guy a previous vault person? What the fuck was that? What is happening here? Same question. Oh! Everyone wants to save the world. They just... They disagree on how. There you are, you little killer.
April 11th. Okay, okay, okay. So like, <laughs> how much of that is directly out of the game versus inspired by the game? Like, is this gonna be a Last of Us TV show where it's like so much of it is beat for beat except for the stuff that wasn't beat for beat and oh my god yes but uh, whatever I'm ready for a second season of that unless it's the second game in which no thanks never thank you great bye but how much of that is the game and how are you guys fans of the game feeling about it like are you excited do you think this is gonna do your your game justice because that looks fun and scary and horrible it kind of looks like something that I would want to watch but then I wouldn't watch because I f would I would be sad and scared. So let me know what you think about that and let's watch the next one. Borderlands, Kate Blanchett. Who doesn't love Kate Blanchett? And Jamie Lee Curtis? And Jack Black? And Kevin Hart? Sounds great, sign me up. Ooh, Kate. Uh oh, God, I hate this plan. <laughs> I love her. Would you look at that? A ladder! Unfortunately, my design doesn't facilitate this type <gasps> of... <laughs> well, destiny awaits. <laughs> Legend has it that there's this massive... This is giving me Guardians of the Galaxy already. Is that... Am I alone in this? Because I'm feeling very... And does the... Does the game give you that, or is it just the beginning of this trailer and it's me who doesn't know? The... Anyways, we'll get back to it. Treasure hidden in some secret vault. I need to rewind to understand this. what she's talking about. Legend has it that there's this oh, right. massive treasure hidden in some secret vault. And if you go hunting for it, you'd better take any help you can get. Okay, and that's the guy. Oh! Because it's on the weirdest, most dangerous dumpster fire of a world in the universe. <laughs> God, I hate this planet. <laughs> also, Firefly-ish. What is that smell? Pisswash gully. Ew! Put the window up. I don't want to! Roll the window up! Roll the window up! It's Pete. It's Pete. Why do you think it's called Pisswash? How did it get the name? It's in my mouth! <laughs> many people have died looking for this vault we have something they don't baby girl okay what major issues <laughs> He's great. Obviously amazing. Step aside, <laughs> Ooh, mine's bigger. <laughs> what are you doing? I needed a gun. So you asked for it. There's only one of you in the world. You're special. Uh-oh. Kill them all. <laughs> oh, oh, that is dirty. What's happening right now? I'm expelling the excess lead. I can't go if you're looking at me. Ooh, actually, scrap that. I can. I really can. Actually, it's helping. Are we really ready for this to finish? Keep looking at me. Oh. That was a stupid joke, but the rest of the trailer was great. All the same questions as Fallout, and it's movies like trailers like that, and movies like that that are, they look high energy, they look fun, they look like they're silly, but they know they're silly, so it's okay. That's the kind of stuff that makes me want to be in movies. Oh, so cool. Ah, uh, okay, yes, that stuff, great. Rosencrantz and Guildenstern, Rosencrantz and Guildenstern are dead, was so great. It's, I'm not gonna say much about it, but it was the physical comedy. Dominic Monaghan and Billy Boyd were, were so funny together, like their chemistry is like palpable, right? Like, I don't know if you've ever listened to their podcast, The Friendship 
Onion, but that was really cool too. And I just, if you haven't read the play or seen the movie with Gary Oldman and Tim Roth, please it, do yourself a favor, read the play, watch the movie, don't read the play, don't watch the movie, whatever, but do one of them because it is so great. And if by chance you are an actor in theater, the Life in a Box monologue from Rose and Crazy Gilson Stern are dead is the most versatile monologue in the world and I love it so much. Anyways, that's my little geek out. That's why I was wearing my, my Lord of the Rings shirt today in honor of Mary and Pippin, whom I love and adore. Uh, I also love and adore you guys. Thank you so much for making it to the end of this video. I am gonna be posting a video on my other channel watching what trailers? Two other trailers. I'm gonna watch Deadpool and Wolverine and The Boys season four trailer on my other channel, which has been extremely dormant. So if you wanna help me out, head over there and uh, check those out too. They might not be up yet. That was optimistic of me. School is kicking my butt because my show opens on the 26th, so yeah. I hope you guys are all happy and healthy, taking care of yourselves and each other, being friends instead. And as always, until next time, may the force be with you. Live long and prosper, and I'll be back.